Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to do a get ready with me and I'm also going to show you how I get my curly hair. Um, so let's start with, um, I wash it just normal in the shower, in the bath, whatever. At the moment I'm using purple shampoo because it is a little bit goldy. Um, so I'm trying to get the gold tones out um, and that reduces that. Um, and I'm using a Herbal Essence Coconut um, Conditioner. Um, it's extra moisture, so that is what I'm using. Also on my roots, I will use the Dove Oxygen Moisture for fine flat hair. I do have quite thin hair, um, and this is just like a root lift spray, but I find this doesn't make my hair as greasy. So I will just spray this just at the top of my head. And just using my fingers, nothing special. I will just sort of massage that in. The next thing I will use is by Tresemme. And this is the Youth Boost. It recharges and youthful fullness. Um, I got this from the pound shop. I also got that dog one from the pound shop as well. Um, but they all do what the shop ones do and for a pound so this is just like a youth boost so I will spray this just all over it doesn't come out as a spray as such it's more of a squirt and mainly I will put this on the underneath because that is what is a lot drier so just put that all over I will try and lower you a little bit actually that was the bathroom door. <laughs> um, we haven't got ghosts. That might be a little bit better. Um, <clears throat> then I will use one of the two. And this is the Tony and Guy Sea Salt Spray. The light is really shining today. And this is Texture and Body. This is the second bottle since Christmas. Or I will use the Got To Be Beach Matte Mermaid Look Texturising sea salt spray these have both have been in my favorite videos um this one does make my hair a little bit crunchy um and if you don't know what that means it's it's if you put mousse in your hair and it goes a bit crunchy so that's what that feels like this makes it just feel like normal hair at bit curly it doesn't actually do anything in particular like to your hair um doesn't make it like crunchy or sticky or anything but this comes out more like a squirt again instead of a spray um, but all I will do is from about there down because obviously I don't want to touch my roots from about there down just where my ear is I will spray this all over I'm sorry if the light keeps going in and out I will sort of get it in my hand just to make sure that I've got all the ends and just squirt it like that then I will go because here on me just like you know your sideburn here it's really curly on me so and it does go a bit frizzy so that is it that is all I do and then I will just wait for that to dry and it may be once it's dry I might have to spray a tiny little bit more on just where I've missed something but I don't run the brush for it again I've run the brush for it once and that was just to detangle it um, let me just but that is it and then that my hair is actually ooh, really really curly anyway let me move you a little bit closer if I can just because I don't know why you're so far away that's a bit better so yeah, I'm going to do a get ready with me and I'm going to do my makeup. I'm really red on the cheeks. Um, yeah, that's about it. That's all I do with my hair. Um, I have tried to use mousse, mousse in the past and I find it's, I can't do it the day after. Um, mousse is okay if you want it for an evening or a special uh, occasion because you want it to last but for every day I just use either one of those sprays and I can get at least th three well no I say at least four days that's pushing it that's really really pushing it with a lot of dry shampoo and everything um, I can get four days out of it so yeah it's not too bad 
my first coffee of the day because I haven't been up that long and I've had a shower. So, first of all, I am going to cream my face with the Nivea like moisturising cream. I haven't been using primer lately just because my face has been so red and really dry. So, I just want to moisturise my skin more than putting primer on it. Um, I know you can get the moisturising primers and things like that and I know Nivea do a primer but to be fair I think this does for my skin this does a nice job of just moisturising excuse my horrible nails but they do need to be painted um, but I really love this colour um, but I find this does a really good job um, it provides intensive moisture, help protect the skin from the sunlight. It has SPF 15 in it, refreshes the skin, and it's got vitamin E and natural lotus extract to give your skin the intensive moisture it needs to support its natural balance. Um, yeah, it does. It moisturises, protects for a fresh skin feeling. And even if I don't put makeup on, I use this every day. Um, I was using the Soap and Glory Marvel Super... Oh, I can't remember what it was called now, but it's like a... It's a, like a primer type moisturising stuff. But I find that it did dry me out a little bit. Even though it was for dry skin, it did dry me out a little bit. Um, I'm going to use my Match Perfection... I was thinking of using my W7, but uh, I just thought I'd use this instead because why not? I haven't actually got a mirror with me. So I'm doing this all from the screen on the phone. So wish me luck. It may be a complete mess and I probably will need a mirror actually. Um, just because I'm not going to be able to do my eyes like that, am I? Oh, the colour. And bearing in mind I'm not as close to the window. Oh, go away! Bloody late. Excuse me for swearing. But to me that's not swearing. I really, really need a mirror. And I don't know where I, what I did with it. Um, oh, I can see it. I'm back there with me and I have my mirror. Um, I'm not doing a really heavy face today or anything like that. Um, we're going to my mum's later just to get some food. Probably get kebab to be honest. We go to the Oh My Cod in Romford, not Romford, in Hornchurch. And it's really nice. The kebabs are so big, even the small, I can't get through. They are absolutely huge and I've said in the past, like, I can't imagine how much wastage that that shop produces. Not from their premises, but the amount of food that they actually give you, I'm sure two people could share a kebab easily. If you asked for an extra pitta. But, that's a bit better. Yeah, easily. Also, I'm really enjoying doing Everyday May, but I don't know whether you can tell, I'm finding it really hard for things to say, things to do. Um, the first couple of days I managed to sort of um, do my wardrobe, do my makeup. I haven't really got anything else to tidy. <laughs> um, it's a really nice sunny day today, but I haven't got anything planned. And I think that we may be waiting for a parcel. Uh, I know Ian's sister is popping around after work. She finishes at half one, I think, um, because I've got a load of clothes for her that I sorted out. Um, for when I did my wardrobe clear out, I've got two bags full. Just some of it she actually gave me and then she lost weight and then I'm giving it to her back because I haven't really worn it um, and I don't want to chuck it away and I thought if she can get wear out of it then she only gave it to me because it didn't fit her so hmm, it's a little bit better 
yeah she only gave it to me because it didn't fit her um and it fitted me because i i was a little bit smaller than her not not by much um but then she's lost a lot of a lot of weight and now she's smaller than me so well done and it's crazy and the clothes that i'm giving her back are probably going to be too big so but she's given me a load of clothes as well and yeah. when we go on holiday we sort of swap and change clothes and all oh, can i borrow this can i borrow that and and, and and bits like that so she she does give me a lot of um swim stuff as well oh nice coffee um but yeah i'm i'm, I'm going backwards and forwards from conversation i don't really know why um i'm really enjoying do everyday may you know like i said i got some um stuff to <clears throat> give her and i i want you to ask me some questions so i can answer them um would you prefer a video every day of me sitting down like this and talking to you or are you enjoying the vlogs because I'm getting a bit, I don't really know what to do. At the end of the month or there may be every couple of days where it's really exciting and I do a lot um, but I'm not really doing anything. I'm being really boring. <laughs> Um, I was on the phone to my mum last night and she goes are you doing anything tomorrow and I was like no and she goes I said to her I said I lead a really boring life like it's mental mentally boring um, but I'm enjoying my crochet and my knitting and I'm getting orders done so it's not like I'm not doing anything I do get orders done from for that and um, bits and bobs do I do hair every now and again and and all that so it's not like I'm actually doing nothing nothing but it would be nice to do something every day and I hate it when I'm just indoors all day because I do get bored but then obviously Ian comes home and he's knackered from work and he doesn't want to do anything so I try and do things during the day if I can wow that's really dark but <laughs> Yeah, I try and do things during the day, but sometimes it just doesn't go to plan. And I'm finding it, not awkward, but I'm still finding it new to look like a ghost, to vlog while Ian's around, or when anyone's around, so I'm still finding that a bit new. If you saw in my vlog the other night when we was having fish and chips, he was trying to make as much noise as possible. But I thought, sod it, I'm going to do it. And I did, and I was really pleased with myself. And um, after that, I thought, at the end of the day, he knows what I'm doing. So, what does it matter? So, I'm, I keep saying so, and someone's pulled me up on it. It is someone that um, Ian knows, so it's not like a stranger. And uh, I just say so, so much. Where on my other channel, I say um, um, um a lot. So, this is my so channel, and that is my um channel. Um, see, God's sake, what am I like? Uh, I haven't even told you what I'm using, uh, am I? This is a good get ready with me. Um, I'm using the Makeup Revolution, the free in one for my contour. I use the Rimmel Stay Matte for my powder. I use the Rimmel Match Perfection for my concealer. You've probably seen all these products before. Um, and now I'm going to use the Makeup Revolution uh, Make Love Instead highlight bronzer this is the bronzer yes no yes yes it's bronzer <laughs> oh my god i hope you're enjoying these because i'm just going a bit crazy i think i think what it was this morning that ain't even coming up off, off of this brush like i said before you need let me try this brush you need a hard brush with these baked products to come out a bit better mm -hmm. <laughs> oh I don't know I'm getting I'm getting more used to this and I'm getting used to being silly and and all that and I am enjoying it so at the end of the day if you don't like watching me being silly then this is not the channel for you 
Oh, what am I like? I don't know. I'm just going a bit crazy. Um, a bit of highlighter, not a lot. So yeah, that's just that's just me. I'm sorry. I can't help it. And I mean, I'm really, really enjoying doing the sit down videos and that, just so I can be a bit silly and be a bit stupid. Yeah, that's me really. And if you know me personally. I can be a bit scatty and a bit silly and act like a child sometimes and I don't really care, that's just me. Um, um, yeah, whatever. I don't care. That That is my, that is just, yeah, whatever. <laughs> oh, I'm hoping I'm really making you laugh because I just, I don't know. I'm off my rocker. So, yeah. And now I just don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just going a bit crazy, really. But anyway. I should be like this on my vlogs, shouldn't I? Really? I should be a bit more wild. But I need things to say, people. <laughs> um, this is the MUA Brow Kit. Pro Brow. Um, I haven't used all of my double W71, but I just thought I'd give this. I've been using this for the past couple of days, so I thought I'd give this a go again today. And what the hell happened now? Oh, got big bushes. That'll do. I'm really not, it, really, I don't know, not that I'm, I can't be bothered today, it's just that I'm in the mood where I just think, hmm, oh well. <laughs> um, my eyebrows really, really need doing, and I do do them myself, so, wow, that one's really bad. <laughs> um, today I am going to do like a pink smoky eye, um, even though I said I wasn't going to do heavy makeup, I thought that. What I'm wearing today, well, my jumper is behind me. What was behind me? What did I do with it? It was behind me. Am I losing the plot? I must be losing the plot. Anyway, it matches my trousers. <laughs> um, as you can see, I'm just really in a scatty mood today. That is just how I am. And I'm in a good mood today. And which is, oh, sorry about the noise. I've got my brush pot here. That's why. Um, yeah, I'm in a really good mood today. And I don't know why. Because I woke up this morning to birds on my gutter board outside my window. And where our ceiling comes down, our gutter boards are in the, like, the middle of the window. Tweeting away, making so much noise. I don't know what the bird was doing, but by the time I got to the window, he'd gone. Got back into bed, back again. So, really annoying. Let me, um, I will try and take a picture or something of the, the gutter board on, and whereabouts it is, but it's so annoying. And it was like he was having a party on the roof. And <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Uh, I'm not drunk, honest. I'm really not drunk. I'm just having a good time today. Maybe it's this coffee. It could be. Anyway, so I'm going to do a pinky smoky eye today. And I got a couple of palettes out. One is the Makeup Revolution Stripped and Bare. The other one is a Colour Chaos Makeup Revolution. I've also got Makeup Academy, and this is just a single shadow. This is in the colour. It's just shade 22. It's not. A, it's just like a pinky colour. And then I have got a black, and this is by Elf. And it doesn't have a shade name, so I just presume it's black because it is black. So I, like I said, I don't want to do a really heavy eye or anything so I just wanted to do like a pink smoky eye um, but I'm enjoying using a little bit more of eyeshadow lately because 
normally I don't really wear anything but I've been using the MUA Captivation palette quite a lot and that is the one with the three shades in one bit I have shown you it before um, if you haven't seen if you're new to my channel then it will be in my latest favorites video I believe it might be in that or if you watch my MUA collection it will 100% be in that so this pink single shade I'm just putting all over my lid then I'm going to go in with a little bit of hmm <laughs> I think that's a bit brownie isn't it mm. then I might go yeah I'm gonna go in with a little bit of this color here just on the crease it's a bit purpley but it's okay it's fine don't worry people we will get there in the end I don't know what look we are going to get in the end, but it will be something. Actually, this is looking rather nice. Um, then, I think, I might go in with that black on in the inner corner. Just a smidgen. Just a smidgen smidgen I really like this color and I don't order from elf anymore because I find their prices have gone up just a tiny little bit then this brush that I got from my beauty college it's a massive like blending brush but I it's it is an eyeshadow brush but I just love it because it's so big and it just blends things so nicely okay then I'm going to go in with I think I might do a nice pop of pink I might do so I, most of my eyebrow my eyebrow most of my eye shadow brushes are from elf or oh, this one's losing the paint on the bottom can you see that it's like it's gone through a sharpener and I can assure you I haven't done that um, so I might use a pop of pink but I might use that coral pink that's really nice hmm I'll show you in the ca color chaos this one here it's more of a coral but I will blend it out anyway Like I said, I don't really know what look I'm going for. It's a bit of a crazy one. But hey-ho. But hmm, it's quite a nice colour, actually. Just blend it out a bit. Blend the middle. Hmm, it's very crazy. Yeah, I like it. I really like it. But then what I'm going to do is go in with... This has got all pink on it now. Then I'm going to go in with a neutral shade just to go bring my crease up a little bit. yes this is a lot brighter than I thought it was gonna be so oh well that's eyeshadow done nothing really that exciting and I'm not perfect but there we go I'm gonna use my brow rimmel exaggerate ex exaggerate ex yeah that that word for my bottom lash just in the inner corner 
outer corner. I told you, I'm going mad today. I don't know what is wrong with me. This video is just going to be like, what the hell is she doing? I don't care. And then I'm going to use the W7 Lash Tastic just to bring my lashes out a little bit. Because this separates my lashes quite a lot. really like this mascara actually because it was from B&M I think and that's a, like a bargain store in the UK I'm just going to wait for that to dry a little bit then for my lips obviously I'm just going to go with something subtle because I'm using one of the Avon samples I really don't know what one to choose I want something that is a bit more subtle than my eyes. Um, 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 um. Yeah, I might go with this. And this is called Nude Nurturing. I have used this a little bit. That is my door. I'm back. Me one moment. By the time I got there, there was no one there. I was going, hello, hello, hello. No answer. These people, they don't, they don't give you two seconds to get up and get to get to the door. Anyway, I am using the nude nurturing, and I think this is a um, like a moisturising one, and it's like a nude. Quite a nice colour actually. I will show you the colour. Excuse my horrible nails. I'll put swatch it on the back of my hand. It's just a nice nude. Um, yeah, and that's it. That is all I'm doing today. And as you can see, my hair. Let me, this is a really mishmash video today. I'm just gonna lower you down a little bit more. Um, in one of them moods where nothing's got to be perfect. I don't care. Let the day be the day anyway this is how my hair is starting to curl as you can see and in here it's getting or it's drying so you can see the curls and obviously the underneath takes a little bit longer but you can see where the color difference is in my hair where this all this part of my hair was red and this part of my hair was natural so Obviously, there was no pigment to actually lift when I bleached when we bleached it. So this has bleached a lot whiter than the rest, and that is why I'm using the silver shampoo, purple shampoo, whatever, um, to get it a bit lighter. And I am only using it on the top half of my hair at the moment. But once my hair is a little bit curlier, it will look really nice. So, yes, that's me finished. My makeup getting ready I am going to find my jumper wherever I put it I thought I put it on the bed hmm maybe not but it is quarter to twelve um, and well I have had a shower I've got up and I did sit in bed for a little while this morning because I just this bird was driving me crazy Um, had a shower obviously got set up for the video and yeah that's about it so I'm going to go and I'm going to make some noise no, I'm going to finish a few things today on my crochet top but that's about it so thank you for watching thank you for subscribing to my channel um, if you are into your crochet your knitting crafting whatever please check out my other channel um, I do a lot of crochet and that um so yeah thank you very much and also on my other channel i have just hit 100 sub or 100 subscribers so i'm so thankful for all those subscribers and i'm so thankful for all of you as well so if you're not subscribed please press that subscribe button and the bell button to be notified when i upload new videos and for the month of may that will be every day as i am 
um, as I am doing every day in May. So please go and check them out. Sorry if it is a little bit boring, but some days will be more exciting than others. And I'm quite sure that other people's lives are exactly the same. I'm going to um, my mum's later. And that is why I have sort of done this look. So yes, thanks for watching. I'm rambling now. So thank you and I shall see you in the next video. Bye.